The south of France is famous for its very special light. And light, of a different sort, is an important business here. This designer lamp costs 5,000 euros. This is a very flat OLED light, the largest in the world. We've held the record for that for three years. The machines can't produce larger ones than that at the moment. That's why we're still limited. You just can't produce larger ones yet. Round OLEDs are the standard design produced here at Astrum Fiam in Toulon. The OLED lamps are made by hand. And they come with the Made in France label often associated with luxury goods. But they also include technology developed in Germany. The company founder takes us to see the nerve center at the heart of this Franco-German project, the clean room. This is where the OLEDs are manufactured. A chemical vapor coating is applied to glass or plastic. The materials come from Germany, supplied by Astrum Fiam's partner company, Novaled. The Germans supply the materials exactly as they're needed. We work with our partner Novaled on various molecules, working out what the dosage needs to be, how many nanometers of which molecules need to be layered on top of each other to manufacture a certain OLED. This bottle came from Germany last week. This alone cost 20,000 euros. And this is where it came from, the city of Dresden in eastern Germany. The Dresden-based company Novaled is a huge laboratory employing 120 people. The head of the laboratory is French, although he speaks excellent German. It's truly a joint French and German project. Omrana Fadhel joined Novaled five years ago. When I was writing my PhD, there weren't many jobs available in France. All the important companies in this area who would employ people with a doctorate in chemistry were in Germany. So I came here. Here in Dresden, OLEDs are only produced for test purposes in order to see how well the chemicals function. Work on organic light-emitting diodes is still continuing. Their lifespan in particular is still too short, but they have huge potential. One day OLEDs will light up our world in a completely different way. They could be stuck to the windows, for example. In the day they'd be transparent, at night they'd light up. These are the kinds of things we're working on, particularly with white light. We want to revolutionize lighting. Back in France, 30 employees are busy making large-scale lights designed for palaces, railway stations or major stores. The Franco-German project has been going since 2007. We're two small companies, and we both have our own cultures. The development of the chemicals in Germany, and the production of the lamps and elegant luxury lamps here in France. And we've managed to bring these two different cultures together. And the two companies serve many distinguished customers. This lamp needs to be perfect. It's for the French interior minister. Je vais le charger un peu après.